One of my favorite new features in 7.2 is the diagnostics menu where you can actually packet capture traffic from different interfaces using filters. We will look at it right now. And of course, use the debug flow. So let's just focus for now in packet capture. So network diagnostic packet capture, we will leave the interface to any, although you can choose any interface that you want to. You can, of course, limit the number of packets and you here can use different filtering options or using specific filter. All right, so let's start by capturing just about anything. All right, let's stop our capture. Now here we can see a table that uh, starts from the time, source IP, destination, and so on. Clicking on any packet that was sent, you can see it's layer three information, source IP, source port, destination IP, and so on. And the layer four information, such as the sequence number and the type of flags that are used. Now, if you'll press the plus sign, you will see more filtering options. You can filter from uh, the specific source IP and you can also filter using flags. So if you want to see only uh, packets that contain the ACK flag or the FIN flags, just apply that and choose it. Let's just apply and here we can see packets that contain an ACK flag. Now it contains ACK flag along with other flags, but it filtered out all the available ACK packets. All right, um, you can of course look at the hexadecimal representation of the packet itself and you can, let's just move to back again, here you can uh, choose a specific host, you can choose a specific port, we can also choose, uh, let's, let's uh, ping and let's look for protocol number one, which is ICMP, so let's open up our command line and execute ping google.com, I have made it, I believe, no, let's just change the options, and make it let's just tab between the repeat count let's make it 200 okay now let's ping again in google and let's choose one and let's start capture and here we can see all the icmp packets now we can stop the capture and we can also do that using advanced filtering let's just choose the protocol but now we can actually write it down icmp and again we have only icmp traffic that is shown here let's stop the capture all right and we can finally save it as a key pickup and um, continue working in wireshark to analyze the different packets